box and lots of hairstyles and today we're just going to show you how to do curl your hair with a fat curling iron and make it look like this. Well I hope you keep watching. A one and a half inch curling iron works great to make thin hair look thick. Just divide her hair into two sections. I'm going to start curling it. This works for thick hair too. I do the same on mine. I'm going to slow this down so that you can see what I'm doing. I roll the curling iron to the bottom and I don't worry about catching the ends until I get to here and I pinch the clamp and twist it so that the hair gets released and it's all nice under the clamp and not getting kinked. Then I hold it in my hand or she holds it until the curl cools down. It takes 5-10 seconds and then I'm going to do the same thing on this side. Watch how I slide that curling iron down. I don't worry about those ends. My ends are sticking out about an inch. And when I get to here, I just pinch that clamp, twist the curling iron, and it sucks those ends right in. It's perfect. Then hold it until it gets hot. The other one's cool enough that I can let it go, so I let that one out, and I hold this one. And then I just hold the curl in my hand. And this saves so much damage on your hair by not keeping it in the curling iron longer, and it holds better and gives it a better curl. So do the same thing over on the side, roll the hair up, hold it until it gets hot, twist it, let it out, and let it cool in your hand. Do the same thing up here with the little wisps up by your face or your bangs. Curl those until they're hot, let them out, and then go to the other side, roll that one up, pinch the clamp, twist the hair so it's not getting kinked, hold it till it's hot, and then let it go in your hand. Super, super easy. Do a little bit of the curls up front, and you're pretty much done. Then I just do one last curl in the back to add a little bit of height and some body and depth to, to the, so it gives it a layered look. And again, I just roll this one up, same as I did the others, hold it until it's hot, let it out in your hand, and I think it gives a really pretty top layer of curls, so let that down. And then I don't want to mess up any of these curls, so I just grab a wide tooth comb, I've done it with a brush too, just be careful, and just comb out that top layer so it looks really smooth. Then spread the bottom curls, get your hairspray, give it a squirt, and then I squeeze it up in my hand when it has the hairspray in. You can shape them how you want with the hairspray, it works great, and it gives it a nice shine, and it holds all day.